Coach, uh, back and forth game here tonight in Belfast. 3-0 down at the first 20 minutes. Um, you must have been very happy with the team's reaction going into the second period. Yeah, yeah. You know what, this is this is three, four weeks in a row now. You know, we come back and, and, and I'm getting interviewed and, and people are saying, hey, great comeback, great fight back. Yeah, it's a great fight back, but we keep putting ourselves in those positions. You know, and we can't keep spotting teams two, three goals. And you know what, I thought in the first period we actually played a very good period. You know, we didn't give up a lot, but uh, we make big mistakes. And our, you know, we're just, as individuals right now, we're just not good enough defensively. We're not playing good enough. It's not ability, but we're not playing good enough defensively. And we're leaking goals because we're making too many big mistakes. And we've got to rectify it. And it's something that, that, that is ongoing. And, yeah, we're, we're doing a great job. We're scoring goals for fun. And that's, you know, that's something when we built this team, we thought we were going to be defensively sound. And offense wasn't going to be maybe our strong point, and it's been reversed. And we got to find a way to be better, or, or we're going to be losing games 6-5, six, 7-6 seven, six the rest of the way. You, you would like to think uh, <coughs> the more, if you score five goals away from home, the likely is you're, you're going to pick up points. Of course you should. You come into the Odyssey and you score five goals, you should win a hockey game. You know, and we get down three goals and, and we fight back. You know, we kill off like nine power plays. Like, you can't, you can't play that hockey on the road. you got to be nice and quiet, nice and smooth, and, you know, play heavy all over the ice and, and, and be disciplined. We, gotta, we talked about it before the game. You know, they're, they're a great team, and you can't give them reasons to beat you. And uh, we just, as individuals, again, as a team, I thought we played very good game. I thought we did a lot of good things, a lot of positives out there. But we gotta, we got to stop these big mistakes. They're killing us. Three and a half minutes to go. Uh, you get a penalty <coughs> for your goaltender holding on to the puck. What was your view on that? It's garbage. I mean, whether it's, you know, there's an area of gray. You know, the, the guy he's, the guy, the, the support guy from our team's behind the net. He's trying to find him. You know, he throws that puck down and a green guy comes from nowhere. It's in the back of the net. You know, it's whatever. I mean, I could sit here and moan about that all. I could, we killed it off. We're back to five on five, and we let a guy skate. We got four guys above the puck. We let them skate right through everybody and, and go top shelf. I, it's listen. It's it's uh, it's one of those things. Like I said big mistakes are hurting us right now, and that's what ultimately cost us this game tonight. You've got a chance to make that uh, good tomorrow. You've got a big game against the Manchester Storm. Yeah, no, huge game, huge game. It's a must win for us now. And you know, although there's 20 games left, a lot of hockey still left. You, you can't look at it that way. We're one game at a time, and we need that one tomorrow. And and you know, certainly we can't spot a team two or three goals to start the game off. There's not a lot of points between 10th place where you are at the minute and fifth place. Still looking to make the playoffs? Of course, of course. I mean, we're not we're not going to get obsessed with the standings right now. It's just for us is is, is picking up points every weekend and in one game at a time, focusing on the process. And you know, after the first period, we we our process was very good. You know, but uh, we killed too many penalties. And then again, like I said, big mistake at the end there cost us a hockey game.